So the outside is painted. It's done finally. The gutters are painted. Cleaner. So yeah, way better than before. I'm gonna remove those things over there that are broken. I don't even know what they are called. The door must go. So this is an empty tour of how the house looks like before it is renovated. Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to the empty tour of Villiers Grill. So I'm just gonna show you guys the house. We painted it last week. So I just wanna take you guys through the house and what we want to do. I hope you guys are gonna enjoy this vlog. I'm loving the lighting. Oh, is it the... It's not that heck. Not bad at all. Okay, cool. It's a phone, so the quality sucks. So let me take you guys through the... I'm gonna call it the empty tour. It's cold, it's cold. Cool. So let's do the empty tour. So, <clears throat> so this is gonna be the main place of the grill where people are gonna chill, eat, do whatever. So it's an open space. You guys would remember that a few weeks back we took down that wall. Like, ah, thick. So, um, Sorry for the swearing. So this is gonna be the main area where people eat, music, we wanna host comedy nights. Sorry for this immature spinning. Um, the roof has been painted white. If you guys would remember, it was a disaster. So I've never taken you guys to the other rooms. So let's go. Kamo is the kitchen, the, the old kitchen. I mean, if you know South Africa, um, with their um, four room houses, apartheid style. So this is the kitchen and as you guys can see, there's still that old stove. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it because it's not mine, it's my cousin's. So I asked the guy who was doing the painting to paint this wall because the gas stove and everything's gonna be here, but I'm gonna get a masking tape so that this line is straight, um, you know, Lines that are not straight are triggering. You all know why. So this side, which I think they called it a spence or something like that, where we are going to be putting our groceries and stuff. So the plan, right, is to get shelves here so that there's a shelf system, change those curtains. I know the passing heck. Here is gonna be, where we're gonna keep the fridge. Um, the fridges, the food, there's still this old cupboard. I asked that it's moved from the kitchen to here because we want space that side. We might just move it back, I'm not sure about it. Or just this one, I don't know. So this is gonna be my office slash store, um, refrigerator, whatever, cold room. You can call it a cold room because I'll have an office here. Then it's changed the lights. It needs to go, and I need to paint this wall, the stores, a different color, probably white. I don't know, I don't know yet, but we still have some gray paint left that we can use to paint the doors and the door frames. Our oh, Spencer, right? Have a kitchen in here, the door must go, the curtains must go. I'm gonna get blinds. Uh, this old vintage light situation also must go. You know, must go. I'm gonna get those straight lights that are much easier to 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 use. But this side, the light not bad. We just need to wash it. You know. Um, but this is the main area where all the magic is going curtains must go we're gonna get blinds also over there we're gonna get blinds over there uh, hey. and then yeah it seems smaller but it's a start you know we don't have money to decorate the backyard which was my initial plan but when I saw how big the backyard was I was like fuck that shit so my plan right is to get an L couch over there see an L couch 
uh, until where this chair is and get like smaller tables so that people even if you're sitting with on one couch you don't feel like you're sharing the couch with the people sitting next to you but we create like smaller nyana pockets of sitting spaces and over there i want to get a long as bench and that long as bench would then represent um would then would then put two tables over here for people to you know to sit and i'm thinking of also because the space is small i'm thinking of getting like round tables one here and one over there so and probably over here but three but this is gonna obs obstruct the door because this door will be leading from the kitchen with the food with the drinks and come this side um, over here there's a plug i'm not sure if you guys can see it so that's where we're gonna put the music system for now i mean <laughs> still have big plans for the backyard but for now to open the business this is where everything is going to happen i had an idea right you see this wall i wanted to put um green um, you know those um, florals that they put nowadays, I wanted to put that or to take like picture frames and put them all over the place, you know, but it depends. It all depends on money and money which I ain't got. But yeah, this is the empty tour of Avilius. Well, would you click and go touch something else? I forgot to show you guys one more thing. Oh, my eyes look good. I should have done this without my shades. So I want to show you guys one thing concerning the floor. I just bumped into this, you see? And it work for two people. So they are a disaster. A total mess. So what I want to do here, of course we're going to clean out this white paint. I'm going to put polish. I'm going to make them shine like a diamond. I hope people don't slip and fall. <laughs> the floors are a mess. So... Still have to clean them out, take these old tiles out, and just put polish. Ordinary polish, and you buy candles and put polish all over the place. So the floors are gonna be polished and they're gonna look shiny. We are doing them a boning aesthetics, honey. So, yeah, the floors. I mean, I know you're judging me. So, thank you for watching. Bye.